This is one of the matches we were talking about being really exciting in 96, and we see it here. Momochi up against Idom. This is a matchup that I was really interested to see. We, you know, don't see Idom traveling too much. He went out to Combo Breaker kind of like, uh, I, I remember him being like after Combo Breaker 2, he, or before Combo Breaker, he's like, should I even go? Should I fly out? And like everybody was like, dude, you gotta do it. Made top eight at that event. You know, he's looked fantastic. So now he's here up against Momochi at another premier event. And when Idom's traveling, to me, it's always very, very fun to watch. And he's such an excellent player. And on the other hand, you have Momochi who has had an excellent year, Evo Japan champion, mm -hmm. right after that second place at NCR where he lost to Punk, uh, I believe it was. And yeah, I mean, he's just, or third place, I believe. Uh, he's just looked fantastic. Final round, that's what I meant. Yeah, second uh, yeah, he to got, he got second final in round. final round, yeah. NCR was Tokido versus Punk. But he's just looked great this year so far, and I feel like, you know, Momochi has a nice set of characters for himself as well. Yeah. So he's just looking awesome. It's cool to see him, you know, finding that success again, playing that play style with Colleen, playing a little bit more Ken occasionally. But, you know, he has better characters for himself than that. You know, for Item, it's going to be Laura. There's no concern about his character getting banned right now. He, yeah. He's here. In large part because of the Street Fighter League, which took place yesterday, the culmination Last night. thereof. Yeah. We saw Punk Team Inferno took yeah. it. Punk well, JB and Broly Legs. That's right. Yeah, that's I was right. going to say that they cleaned it up. Excellent work to them. It was close in the finals. $30,000 to the first place team. 10000 yeah. each. That is incredible. Nice chunk Congrats of change. to those folks. Everybody who got to the top four teams at CEO was paid out. So yeah. shout out to them. That's super cool. But so he did have some experience yesterday, and his, you know it's going to be Laura for him. There's no alternative, as we saw in the SFL. Yeah, There's so no Ken, other character. Ken from Momochi, which is cool to okay. see. Wow. I, I've seen him play this character a little bit more lately. The one thing that I have to imagine he likes in this matchup is strong low-medium kick to interrupt under the fireballs and stuff, or uppercut, right, to, to deal with it as okay. well. And, you know, this is... Laura's not a character who has amazing ground buttons, so, you know, Ken doesn't have the best choices either. And okay. that means in a matchup like this where Momochi's ground game is excellent, you know, he can really take advantage of that. Yeah, Although, as a player, he's, he's fantastic at that. The fireball game from IDOM is next level. It's, I, it's like nothing else. There's nobody else in the world who plays Laura who has anything approaching to that fireball game. It's crazy. Command throw early from IDOM. Uh, tried it again, actually. Nice punish. Just a little Gets bit of bar with the V-Skill kick. Very smart. Again, the fireball timings are so strong right now out of Idom. Yeah. Using that in order to create pressure for himself. That Momochi time goes, in the trouble. He goes for the frame trap after the medium punch that time. Momochi hit a button, gets the counter, Got and activate. Got him to Goes for the mix-up. Wow, stuck in a button at the right moment. Yeah. Again! These, look at this! Look at this! Momochi in big trouble! Ooh, gets the counter hit combo, medium toss. Oh, he can win if he takes the next. Anything. Just find, find anything. It's okay. He Wake up standing strong. Yeah, he did front throw, and instead of walking up and trying to meet or anything, he's like, I'm just going to go for the jump, right? To try to force the issue. I and jumped yet. He won't be ready for that. I'd almost ready. Wow, reversal, low medium kick, hit confirm from Momochi. Looked like Ultra Street Fighter 4 when Ken had that four frame, crouching medium Lincoln. kick. Plus frames, and yeah, he's out of there with the V reversal. Oh, walk up throw. The brave walk. Important thing to do when your opponent's negative like that and you know they're not going to hit a button. Punish! Punish. Surprising to see Fierce uh, come out in that way. Out of Idom. Rare. Not ready for the run. Well, what's he now pressure? Idom with a lot of resources. If he can just find the chance, I don't know that he will. Double EX fireball. Mochi runs up. Looks uh -oh. low. Okay, out of there. I don't want to deal with this. Walk up Woo! sweep. Beautiful. And you know he's just waiting. Oh my god, he waited so long. He just kept it so safe, too. V reversal it's again. It's still there, it's still there! That was old. It's still there, can you believe it? It was out forever, okay, and then Momochi okay, okay. walks up. The thing that was scary there, too, is that he did the overhead. He tried to do reversal jab, and the fireball clipped him for a second. I thought Adam was going to have something, you know, placed there to kind of combo off it or something, but he had quite enough time. Momochi with the grab this time. Trying to take advantage of that post elbow situation. Back dash again. Out of there. I like it a lot. Yeah. A, the proximity guard on that is yeah. pretty big. You can't so. just walk out. Yeah, you have to back dash. It's one of the few things that has huge. Wow, that was a great read on the back dash. Hey, I don't take his turn. Yeah, missed great the Great block. Here's a punish. When back she's canceling into stuff, she cannot cancel into a low. It's overhead only. Yeah, what an anti air and the meaty combo. Hold on. He was hoping to see something reckless out of Momochi, but nothing came. Yeah, you can't get hit low here. Crouching medium kick seals the deal. Yes. And so does Crouching Medium Punch. Ooh, he jab. tried. Here he goes. It's still there. It's still there. 
in the front. Oh, I don't need one more mix up. They both do. Oh, he got, got the cross. Oh, no, hold on. No combo. He jumped in. He and made then the it. big bait. Item takes game one. That, I cannot believe Momochi uppercut. I, like, that was one of those moments I thought he was just going to block for sure. He but had been blocking. He yeah. had been patient. Maybe that's why he did it. He thought, wow, I've played this entire game without doing anything reckless at all. Yeah. Here it comes. That was such a good block from Item. So, like, jump in. Everybody there is like, command throw a strike, right? Just like that. Sure. Yeah, every other player. But he's just like, all right, I got to block. What a game. Yeah, Momochi Both sticking it out with Kent, really. too. Yeah. Man, that standing light kick buffer from Laura is so good. Wow, oh, whip punish. Oh, oh. The way Adam plays that range with the fireballs and his whip punishing and the buffers on the stand light kick, it's so hard to do. It's such a terror at that spot. And it's so hard to get experience against somebody who plays in that style. This doesn't exist outside of this guy right here. Yeah, again, Momochi just has to backdash. And that's been really what he's done for most of the set. There's been a lot of backdashing, a lot of jumping back. He then has to keep moving forward himself. He finds an opportunity. Really super, yeah. Yeah, spend the bar on that. Double uppercut. Cleaned it up. And that was a good choice. He needed kind of a stable round like that after the last game. I think with how, you know, crazy it got at the end, it's like, all right, I really need to kind of slow down and make this okay. Nice work from Momochi. Mm-hmm. Oh, walked up. And then, yeah, you see the backdash yeah, again. Very consistent. And that's nice. That means that he doesn't have to contend with what Laura's going to do. But you can't do too much of it or else you're just going to get caught. I love that dash up after the fireball. Knew it was going to hit. Hit a button after got the counter hit. Stays in front. Mm -hmm. Okay, Momochi out of there. And again, this is close to stun. Next one. Great block. Yeah, Adam well space. His turn. Still does not have trigger. He blocks anything. Yes, got it now. Clashes on the fireball. Backs up. Not forcing the issue on this stun. Sets it up. That's going to continue for a ways. Oh! His range on that's crazy! Yeah, back throw after. Charges the fireball a bit. Three, Three framer. framer. That Tatsu is a great choice. Oh, plus frames. The upper Got it this time on what she was right. With the backdash got clipped out of the air. Oh my god, suddenly a burst forward from Momochi and he takes the game. It was like both of them. They both just ended up in the same spot at the same time and they're like, whoa! And yeah. Momochi panicked through. He was like, oh, I gotta get out of here. <laughs> yeah. So it worked out for him. Game of peace. Looking good. Trying to stay in winner's bracket. Yeah, that was a little scary of a match. You can feel that even when Idom has such a big deficit, like the way he kind of marches you down with Laura is terrifying. You're like, uh, how did I get ants here from half screen? And there's a fireball there, and I'm gonna, oh, that's a command throw, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm trying to play at this spot. That's where he wants to be, right there. Man, harassing in front of you. He walked up and Idom just threw a fireball at him. <laughs> right in his face. It's worked pretty, pretty well. There's a punish. He was in the perfect space that time. Mochi becoming a little bit more comfortable. He's one of those people you can't test his spacing too often. Back dashing again away from the fireball. And oh, wow. V skill. Command grab. Hoping to crush something. Nothing came. And here's Idom now. Exactly where he wants to be. You know he's got the anti air. Oh. And he thought he had walked out. Yeah, he tried to walk back and bait that. He was trying to block or just walk away from a grab. He just misplaced it there. So Momochi getting away. There's still quite a bit of time on this. Has to. Well, that was a beautiful punish too. Momochi yeah. was ready beautiful. for it. He was like, you know what? I have this back strong fireball activate. Beautiful block. And again, that commitment to the overhead. I think if you're item and you've seen that twice, you need to just start V-Skill like command throw or V-Skill, you know, mix up or something like that instead of just going for V-Skill overhead because yeah. he's just walking back to block it. Yeah, and it's not like Momo, she's pressing a lot of buttons defensively to get crushed, you know? Yeah. That, that hasn't really occurred very, long, very often. A trade on light kick on the other side for the anti-air. We see Momochi Idom. has not pressed a button in like 15 seconds. No, yeah, and Idom's in hot pursuit. He's chasing him down. Momochi's just running for it. Walks up and checks with a jab in that range. Advantage, There's a command throw. Yeah. You know, continue here. Okay, EX. Yeah, until that moment, he's been blocking so much that I like Adam just going for the command throw. It's sure. Like, you know, he's being evasive, but he hasn't stuck out that many buttons. Adam has never jumped forward. No punish because he jumped back. Here we go. What's he got? 
grab item just takes it. Willing to reset things. Feeling confident here. Oh, oh underneath! And then the command grab comes, and we are at match point for both players. Just like that. I mean, it, it feels like he just recognized what to do. He's like, all right, he's running. He's, you know, dodging, he's diving. I just got to get in there and enforce my will a little bit on this. And Momochi, you know, he's not hitting any buttons, and because of that, I think he ends up in that position a lot. While the back dash to try to bait the throw, Momochi with the jump back. Here he goes. Chance for pressure. Oh, I don't pressing a stand jab on Wake Up, most likely. Got him again! I don't. Very buttonsy all of a sudden, and Momochi has turned it on. So not long. gonna have super, but very close. Yeah, next it'll build it from Momochi. Walks oh, back, he's looks looking low. for it. Yes, he definitely wants that. He got it! He dashes up for the low, and that round just vaporized. Momochi completely dominated it. I don't thought it was time to press buttons defensively, and it was not. Yeah, you could feel it that that round, like Momochi, after that jump back in the corner worked, it was just boom, boom, boom. And we've seen a lot of wake up jab from Idom. So yeah. I think that Momochi calling it out with the stand jab was a good choice. Every time he lands the X Tatsu, I feel like in that set, Idom.